When the mercury falls, many of you may go outside and warm up your car, but if you left the car running with the keys inside and then went back inside your home, you are breaking the law. And as News Channel 5's Amy Watson explains, it doesn't matter if it was on private property or not. Who doesn't like a comfortable car ride in the cold winter months? So you warm it up a bit before you head down the road. But police warn you've created a tempting target for thieves. Anytime you operate a car and you exit that car, whether it be at a gas station or if you pull into your residence or business and get out leaving it running, you run the risk of someone jumping in it and driving away in it. In fact, Metro Code 12.40.200 says that it is illegal to walk away and leave your car running with the keys in it, even in your own driveway. Late November up until probably February, we see a lot of car thefts involving keys being in the vehicle running warm-up theft. And just in the past month of 87 vehicles stolen in Metro, 39 of them were left running. That's almost half. It doesn't surprise me that we get high volume of numbers because that's a trend. Uh, it surprises me that people continue to leave their cars running unsecured. Just to be clear, the only way that you can leave your car running, whether you're in your work parking lot or your own driveway, is with a remote start key ignition button. So you have to decide, is the risk worth a little chill? And isn't it better to have a cold car than no car? Amy Watson, News Channel 5. Metro's Auto Theft Division tells us the fine for leaving your car running is usually at the judge's discretion.